Hey guys, this is Steve with uh, Handyman Bro, and today was going to be the continuation of a toilet tank that I fixed, and I repaired it with this Gorilla Glue Heavy Duty Ultimate, but I can't find the actual video. It's been deleted. It something happened to it. So basically, in this video, all I'm going to do is go to the toilet tank that I repaired. It's been two days now, and we're going to fill it up with water, see if there's any leaks. Then I'm going to put an update. This one I will post as is, and then a little later I'm going to make an update, maybe a week, two weeks down the road, to see if it's still holding water. Now, I, I went through that video in detail as I used acetone to clean the edges to make sure I can get a good bond. As I, I did that, then I pressed them together so it will stick well. Made sure I had a bead coming all the way down. And any spot that was cracked, I cleaned them well. I know I don't have the footage to prove it, but that's what I did. And I took my time on it, made sure I did it well. I uh, wore rubber gloves. So my oils from my finger did not contaminate the seal. So right now, I'm going to take you to where the toilet is. Turn on the water to it to see if it fills up. Look around it with a flashlight. And hopefully, we do not have leaks. So come along. Okay, so we got the water turned on uh, to the power to the, the main supply so now we're going to turn this valve to turn it on to the toilet all right it's on it's filling and you can see where I have the the um that gorilla glue so it's in there and we can look around and there's no water on the floor so that's a good sign So, hold on, let it fill up. You know. I'll have to adjust that. It's, uh, I'm going to adjust that. So go ahead and flush it. Alright, let's look right here. Let's let it be. Yeah, that's dirty. Alright. It appears to be holding water because there's nothing coming out. Nothing coming out of there. Nothing coming out of there. So I don't see any. I don't see any leaks. So I will make an update video. I don't see any leaks anywhere. I don't see any anything on the tanks. I don't see anything on the floor. But I will make an updated video. This has been the second day, uh, so it's been over 24 hours since it since I put pl applied it. It's a gift to 24 hours for cure time, depending on uh, the temperature. Uh, at least over 40 degrees, and it's been well over 75, 80 degrees. So I do believe that um, 48 hours is sufficient and enough for the testing. So I will give an updated video in about a two, two to uh, maybe one to two weeks, maybe three weeks, depending on what else I got going on. And then I'll see if I'm still holding water. Uh, thanks for watching. If you like this kind of content, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button to help the algorithm out. And uh, see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.